I'm posting a quick update to my Voodoo Darkening because I had a theory. Uh, in our previous experiment, we used titanium whites with different, I believe it was ivory black mixed in. Uh, and we saw that Voodoo Darkening did happen across the board. Uh, and it happened more often with thinner applications, which were, uh, that darkened more significantly than thicker applications and the stand oil did help a little bit. So I had a theory that the uh, earth tones maybe were partially responsible. So um, what I'm using here was a Williamsburg neutral number six and number eight, uh, which are both made with titanium along with, I believe, raw umber and ivory black. So I also did a test here with cad red deep and also a phthalo blue. So my understanding of those is they aren't like natural earth tones uh, or, or, or more synthetic uh, pigments. I could be wrong, but again, I'm just theorizing here. Uh, so I did this test again. I mixed up these uh, mixtures. They're still wet. This is originally what I did put down. There's no medium added, no solvents, no nothing. This is just paint and the mixtures. Uh, and so what you're seeing here is that even with the in uh, the not organic pigments, we are still getting the voodoo darkening. So here you can see a thin application. And with a thin application, you would expect to see a brighter, lighter value of the pink or the blue because of the transparency of the paint and the white of the surface underneath. However, what you're seeing here is this new application of the fresh, wet paint, the new application looks lighter. So this is counterintuitive to what you would expect to see with oil paint. So I am still seeing voodoo darkening happening with the thin application. It is very, uh, almost not noticeable in the thicker applications. The thicker applications definitely did not sink in as much. Now sinking in would normally make the paint appear lighter than it actually is. This is evidence in our darks usually. But what's happening with the titanium mixtures is for some reason, the thinner applications that do sink in, there's a visual darkening, which when you then go to match to, uh, it's, it's actually quite challenging because your wet paint, even though this was the exact same mixture, is lighter than the previously applied thin application. So I've had some students saying that they're cast paintings tend to look darker after they come back to them. And if they're painting thinner and things are tending to sink in, something is happening with the mixture so that they darken. So these are the Williamsburg 6 and 8. Uh, they are also doing it, the darker value is doing it actually even more significantly. Uh, but it is still evident in the lighter value. So I just wanted to post an update that uh, the theory that the raw umber or ivory, ivory black was partially the cause of the voodoo darkening seems to be actually happening with other pigments as well. Good luck.